Okay, so we ran out of this stuff for the Swiffer. My daughter says you can't take the top off. I mean, she wasn't really wrong because it was hard as heck to take the top off, but I managed to put a vice grips on the top and uh, it started to crush it a little bit, but it came off. Well, I put the top on, I filled it up with water and palm olive soap, just a little bit, you know. So we'll check and see if it works. Well, the moment of truth. Juice is coming out. I guess we fixed it. Well, we made some chicken and a little can of that, or a little box of that minute, minute rice, onions and cashews. And uh, the keg uh, steakhouse uh, chicken and uh, chicken and ribs spice. So see how that works out. That's it. Okay, you remember the other day I told you? Well, I bought this in the summertime. And it comes with three heads. So here's one of the heads, but remember I, I kept on telling you it falls off. So basically this is a push. You push this in, yeah. And it's not actually going in. So, and it comes out very easily. So I decided to, I decided to put it in like this, flip it over. I already pre-drilled this hole because I did it earlier. But just to show you, it was like, just take this, try to find the closest to the center as possible. Put that in. And now, take this. Put it through like that. I got a washer. I got a wing nut. If you want it super tight, put a wrench or a socket on the end of this, and there you go. But now, it doesn't come loose, and it's firm. What I'm going to do, I got th two more heads. I'm going to put the heads on and just follow the pre-drilled hole that I did and just pop it in. So, yeah, hopefully it'll work. Anyways, that's it for now. Okay, good morning, everybody. This is the old handle I put on there. Uh, and basically, I didn't realize it, but I'm shooting blind with this one because the hole is on the, on the stick and not on this, so I have to transfer that somehow. I figured out a way to do it, and it's by putting a piece of tape, putting a piece of tape on the old one, and right where the hole is, we have to bark it. I put, uh, got my drill together. I'm using a quarter inch bit. As you can see, I marked my my handle, and now I'm going to proceed to make the first hole. Let's hope this is accurate. Okay.
Now, well, and no, it's not accurate. I'm off. I'm off by a little bit. So. There you have it. Now I got my head on. It's still stiff. It's not going anywhere. I just need to tighten it up. I was off by about, I was half on, half off. So I had to move it over a little bit and then drill right through it again. And yeah, it works. It wasn't pretty, but you can't see nothing because I have a washer there. So you don't see the little extra divot in there. Anyways, that's it for now. Uh, hope you, you know, if you, if you got one of these and that's the problem, that might work for you. Okay. Ciao. Next thing I made. I bought these on Amazon. I bought them before when I made that attachment for my wheelchair. I don't know where I put it, but... This thing fits iPhone 12 Pro, I guess. That's what I got. But it it doesn't really fit the iPhone 11 Pro Max. Uh, I tried it, and yeah, it didn't seem to want to stretch enough. At least this one here, this the thing that I'm using now, that's the one that mounts my wheelchair and stuff. Yeah, it doesn't fit. Uh, well, this should fit sideways here, sorry. This is the Pro Max, should fit sideways. I'm mistaken. This does fit sideways. So, if you mount it like this, the straight bar coming out, you can turn this around, and there. You can do your video with that. So it does fit. Miss this one yet, but uh, these are all old parts, but I and this part I had this whole pipe, so I gotta go out and get myself a pipe cutter. I was using a hacksaw, which is all right, but it makes a little bit of a mess of pipe cutter. You know, you can just, and you can use it on different sizes of pipes. This is probably the biggest pipe I'm gonna use, so. Yeah, I just got an end cap, an elbow, and I'm gonna sort of like measure how long the neck should be. I still gotta figure out how to mount it. I might just drill a hole in a piece of wood and mount it that way. I'm waiting for some magnets to come, so yeah. But it works too. I mean, as far as I know it does. In theory it does, so we'll see.